Hey, what's going on? Joshua Elder here. Welcome back to the channel. Today, I want to talk about a very important subject when it comes to affiliate marketing. And that subject is paid traffic. You see, a lot of people feed you this dream that you can make affiliate marketing work because you can have the possibility of putting $1 in getting $2 out or putting $1 in getting $4 out. But what they don't tell you is that you need to learn ads manager, that you need to learn copywriting, that you need to learn funnel building, that you need to learn how to create an effective email follow-up series more often than not. Yes, there's products like Commission Hero that have come out where some people have the potential to succeed, but the problem is it's relying on ClickBank products and ClickBank products do get saturated. They get saturated on the Facebook marketplace. They get saturated you know, via SEO. They get saturated across the internet. And if you're not one of the first people to be there you know, to market it, then it's gonna be very, very difficult to succeed. So I would highly, highly recommend that you do not start with paid traffic because number one, you really have to be a master of all these different trades. And number two, the chances of you succeeding are very, very low because of the profit margins with affiliate marketing. Most affiliate programs will pay like 50, 70, even 90% if you're super lucky. But then you have to, you know, like again, I explained, you have to learn copywriting, you gotta learn funnels, you gotta learn all that other stuff to make it work. And to learn all of that stuff at once for the average person, heck, for me when I got started, was very, very difficult. So what do you do? What's the only other option to succeed with affiliate marketing? I'm gonna tell you what it is right now. It's learning free advertising strategies, okay? And it's doing a little bit of grunt work uh, consistently every single day. You see, it's, it's about building a following. It's about building a brand in one specific niche. And a lot of people, they overcomplicate this by going in way too many niches, going in way too many directions because they hear how to crush it in crypto one day, then they hear how, how to crush it in the health industry the next day, um, and they just get overwhelmed. But at the end of the day, it's really making the decision that you're going to go into one niche and you're going to stick with that niche long term. And you need to stick with it long term, especially if you're going to do free traffic, because free traffic is slower traffic. It does take time, but there's a really cool compounding effect that takes place when you leverage free traffic strategies. Let me put this in perspective. When you upload a video or you upload a blog post to a website, it takes time for Google to crawl that video or crawl that website using their little bots to figure out what that website's about. And then what needs to happen is they need to gather data from viewers. So what they'll do is they might rank you temporarily like towards the top of the search engine. If you notice like your YouTube videos go to the top or your websites go to the top really quickly and then you're really excited, but then like a day later, a couple of days later, they go down. Well. YouTube is actually giving you some free impressions on people to see if those people are going to stay on your content long enough uh, to really have Google give that website or that video credit so it maintains its rankings or it might dance around. But the key is, is Google and YouTube, they're gathering data on your content to see really where to place it over the next 30 to 60, even 90 days. And so as that's happening, you're not getting a lot of traction. But after that time passes, and let's say you've got 30 pieces of content, and now you know, 60, 90 days have passed, those, those rankings are really going to set in place in YouTube's and Google search engine. And that's where you'll see that compound effect of a lot of traffic come in at once. And so you really need to learn the law of delayed gratification. You really need to be consistent. And that's really what's separating people that are succeeding versus people that are failing. There's tons of free content out there on how to start a successful affiliate marketing business. But why do so few people still succeed? Well, they don't realize this is a marathon and not a race. The people that stick around in one niche long enough are the people that are going to succeed. The people that put out the most consistent, valuable content over a long period of time 
are the people that are going to succeed. You need to make sure that you're there for your audience, regardless of whether they're gonna purchase from you or not, which means you have to genuinely love helping people. You have to genuinely love what you do. You have to genuinely love talking about whatever niche topic you're talking about. And you're gonna notice that your income is in direct proportion to the value that you give to people. So if you give a lot of value to your following, you might not see the fruits of that labor at first, but again, that delayed gratification, when those rankings start to set in, in Google's and YouTube search engine, you're gonna see a lot of results fairly quickly in the long run. So that's, that's the fastest way to get rich quick overnight, is to do the work today so you can reap the rewards months from now or even years from now. Because I understood how technology worked, how the internet worked, I knew that all the content that I was putting up wasn't gonna make me money today, so I went from the employee mindset to the entrepreneurial mindset because I knew, once again, how it worked. I knew that 60, 90, 120 days plus, boom, I was gonna see the fruits of my labor. And that's exactly what happened. I remember it was April of 2013 or 14 when I saw my first $1,000 commission come through from the videos that I put up on my YouTube channel over the past couple months. And my mentor told me, just stick at it, keep going, keep giving value. And that's part of the science of getting rich. There's actually a science to getting rich. The more value you give, the more money you're gonna get in return. So just keep that in the back of your mind as you're grinding it out day by day and you're not seeing the results. Maybe after 90, 120 days, you're, you're still not seeing results where there's something that you're doing in your marketing that you need to fix. Maybe there's some SEO strategies that you need to get better at. Maybe your messaging and your videos need to be more engaging and better. So I would take into account these things, research these things. Again, those are available on YouTube. Uh, I'll post some links below that will help you with your search engine optimization, aka uh, that's really how you optimize your content and your, and your videos to make sure that they're actually seen and ranked by the search engine. So wanted to create this really quick video to let you guys know, number one, don't do paid traffic. When you're getting started, do free traffic, do it long term and understand the value of delayed gratification. Know that the work that you do today will impact you tomorrow. Hope you got value from this video. If you did, let me know by uh, going ahead and giving me a like below. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already because I'm uploading videos consistently teaching you how to build a life and business full of freedom, passion, and fulfillment. And tick that bell icon to be notified of all future videos that I upload when I upload them. And we'll go ahead and see you guys in the next video. Take care.